I was watching the news yesterday as Tate and his brother Tristan got released from jail on house arrest right now I read a lot people are like well there's still there's still charges against them there's still they're still under investigation it's done it's finished it's done it's finished if you guys don't think that Andrew Tate and his brother are gonna become the biggest influencers you guys don't understand the internet you don't understand what they represent that's the, that's the thing which I always say don't don't get angry at the fact that somebody's doing something understand what he represent you can't kill an ideology a philosophy you can't kill his brother said something very interesting they're rapists they're killers even dictators killed a lot of people think of this killed a lot of people they get to keep their Instagrams why is that why is that because the higher ups the people which are most powerful in the world right they understand one thing about power the most powerful thing is if you can control the boys you can control the world because to be honest I don't give a damn about what people are saying all this feminine all this and that it's great yeah we can sit and we can write treaties but when it actually comes to it we the men we run the world put 10 boys with one mission in one room and see what's going to happen i find it very interesting that he said that that he said all of these people on instagram all of these murderers, rapists, killers are on Instagram, but they take away me and he hasn't even posted. And the crazy part about that, the craziest part is not even the, the fact that he hasn't posted, is the fact that he was in jail and they took it away. Because they hate him so much. That's how, that's how much they fear Andrew Tate. An enemy of my enemy is my friend. I don't give a fuck what people are talking about. They're saying some shit about Trump. You hear the media every day, this and that. Why are they spewing so much of this? Why? For what reason? Have you ever been with a girl before and you look at her and you're like, I think you like that guy. No, I don't like him. And then you see the girl kissing the guy the next day. I think you like that guy. No, I don't like him. He's an asshole. He's a douchebag. If you don't like him, why are you so triggered? That's why I find so fascinating about Tate. If you don't like him so much, why are you so triggered? It works backwards, that thing, right? The attraction, it works backwards. It's not about sitting there and saying, I'm attracted to this person. This person says the right thing. It's that push and that pull. He's doing something which you disagree with, but you're very interested in Tate. I know there are a lot of women which might say, I don't want a guy like Tate, but if you just take away Tate and then you just say, hey, do you want a, a strong man? Check. Do you want a man that makes more than you? Check. Do you want a, a man which is good with the ladies? Check. Do you want a, a man which has slept with a lot of women? Check. It's fascinating. That's why I say do not listen to women sometimes. But not only women, there's a lot of bitch ass niggas. And I gotta call them out in this video, to be honest. The first people which I want to call out is Abba and Preach. I used to watch the videos before. I thought that their videos were actually good. I was a big fan of them. But lately they've, they've just become bitches. And I saw this video of them kicking Sneeko while he's down. I get it. You guys hate Sneeko. You hate Tate. I get that. I understand. And I'm not even going to talk about H3H3, that fat bastard. I'm not going to talk, I'm not going to talk about that fat bastard because he's he's just dumb he's just he has just sold himself he's just dumb but Auburn preach ugh, ugh. look at those two you're kicking a man while he's down think of the sneaker went to another platform continued creating they, they they shut his whole thing down his whole livelihood and still he became a millionaire he's built different that's what I'm saying the people which you fear the most are the people which are better than you. 
you know it like there's nothing you can do doesn't matter how many times you make up shit about this person doesn't matter how many times you call them things doesn't matter the man still stands there he still stands there and they try to do that to Tate they put him they took away everything away from him and then they threw him in a cell and two things can happen in that scenario two things can happen you can either crumble under pressure or you can become something else and we've seen the greatest leaders in history every single every single person has been there the crucifixion as they call it and he was he experienced his crucifixion they did it in public they went for him they fired their best shot against this guy they went for him and as I saw him pacing around right in that video where he's pacing back and forth back and forth back and forth back and forth just like my grandfather used to do that also back and forth back and forth back and forth back and forth he's bred in this it's almost like that scene you know that that Bane scene when Batman shoots off the lights or he like cuts out the lights and he's like I was born in the dark just that Bane scene it reminds me of that Bane scene when he's pacing back and forth back and forth back and forth back and forth and you can see them locking him up made him different if you feared Tate before if you're afraid of this man before now you've created something else now I'm telling you guys like subscribe to the channel I'm not not even lying about this subscribe to the channel continue watching because I've, I've called it out I've been right about all of these things and it's not like oh I'm trying to do it because no it's just the person that I am if I think that Eminem is trash I would say it I'll say it right to your face I think that that guy is trash it doesn't matter how many people try to convince me that shit is 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 a fucking cake it's still shit at the end of the day it's still shit so what you're gonna tell me oh yeah just because they are trying to spoon feed you that shit the coffee's hot the coffee's black the da 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 and then you guys are writing in my comments saying well what kind of songs have you made or where are you on the billboard just because it's shit it, because shit is on the fucking billboard does that mean that it's good I find you guys, you guys are so fucking, like, people are so fucking funny sometimes. I got hate. People didn't want to talk to me because I had an opinion. People hated me because I had an opinion. I had an opinion. I stood for it. I didn't bend. I didn't break. I didn't fold. I had an opinion. I stayed at it. I said, that's what I think. If, if you guys have something against it, fuck you have an opinion it's dangerous to have an opinion nowadays they're doing the same thing to me guys my channel is getting demonetized this this video is gonna get demonetized it's gonna get demonetized 100% but now I've started to figure something out guys you have to stick to your guns I understand I understand Maybe we have to go through something in order to create history. So it's okay. Dad is always ostracized. Dad is never going to get that trophy. Dad ain't never going to get that, that trophy. He's, he's, just, he's just there. But at least he gets the respect. <sighs> Watch that guy, bro. Watch him. Because when I was pacing back and forth like that, They created something else. They've created something different. And it's going to be very interesting to watch. Um, I just have to say, shout out to Tate. Fuck all the people which hated on you, or talking shit. Which, even that, that guy from Vice, that fucking snake. If you hang around snakes long enough, they're going to bite you. That guy from Vice. Ugh. I hate Judas. Judas. But anyway, guys, like, comment, and share if you like videos like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.